Social and Emotional Learning, or SEL for short, teaches children how to have healthy relationships, how to identify and manage their emotions, how to set and achieve goals, how to have empathy for others, and make responsible decisions. Social and emotional learning programs have been around for decades, and results from all the scientific research show that SEL not only helps raise grades, test scores, and graduation rates, but also reduces anxiety, depression, and behavioral issues. The National Center for Education Statistics reports a 21% increase in bullying since they started tracking this information in 2003. 160,000 students miss school every day, and one in 10 kids drop out of school altogether because of bullying. The rate of suicide continues to increase. We have almost 40% more suicides than murders every year in the U.S. Drug use continues to skyrocket as well. There were more deaths from drug overdoses last year than ever before. Illegal drugs now kill more people than cars and guns. The Child Mind Institute's 2015 Children's Mental Health Report states that 49.5% of American youth will have had a diagnosable mental illness at some point before they are 18. The majority of this diagnosis is anxiety. The average onset age of anxiety is six years old. Most of these kids won't receive professional help. What are the long-term effects of untreated anxiety? mental illness, depression, suicide, violence, incarceration, and substance abuse, just to name a few. Clearly, some of the programming we have in schools today to address these issues is not effective. Statistics show these same issues are increasing despite our efforts. The American Journal of Public Health did a study in 2015 on the lifetime impact of teaching students social and emotional learning. They found that kindergartners with higher SEL skills were twice as likely to obtain a college degree and almost twice as likely to have a full-time job by the age of 25. Those kindergartners with less social and emotional skills had a 67% higher chance of having been arrested in early adulthood, a 52% higher rate of binge drinking, and an 82% higher chance of being in or on a waiting list for public housing. These are dramatic results and highlight the importance of making sure your child has access to social and emotional learning. SEL is highly teachable at any age, and the undeniable research results prove it is not only essential, but has the potential to transform and save lives. When we think about what we want for our children, what I want for my surviving son, it is for them to lead meaningful, happy, healthy, and purposeful lives. We want them to be successful with their friends, families, and at work. SEL gives them the tools and skills they need and the optimal chance to do this. These skills and tools aren't innate, but they are easily taught and learned. Teachers and even future employers value SEL as tools, skills, and attitudes necessary for success. Traditionally, we focus on easily measured metrics, such as IQ or intellectual intelligence, but studies show that EQ or emotional intelligence is a more significant indicator of future success in all areas of life. A recent study done on evidence-based SEL programs by Columbia University found an $11 present value return for every $1 invested in SEL. I can't think of a better investment than our youth. Social and emotional learning is by far the most proactive and preventative mental health initiative we have today. All the scientific research points to SEL being a mandatory part of our children's learning environment, providing them with the skills, tools, and wisdom they need to be physically, mentally, and emotionally resilient, connected, and kind, giving them the best chance to lead happy and productive lives.
The Sandy Hook Advisory Commission report came out two years after the tragedy at Jesse's Elementary School and said it could have been prevented with SEL. Jesse died from what I hope is the ultimate form of bullying. We all want our kids to be safe. SEL is the most effective way to cultivate a safe and positive school climate and culture for your child. There are many great social and emotional learning programs available. Make sure your school has one of them. SEL could have saved Jesse's life and the life of the shooter. The Jesse Lewis Choose Love movement worked with dedicated educators who created and use our free comprehensive social and emotional learning program in their own classrooms. It's called the Choose Love Enrichment Program. This free, evidence-based SEL program incorporates effective learning such as emotional intelligence, neuroscience, positive psychology, character values, and mindfulness. It teaches students and their educators how to choose love for themselves and others by bringing love intentionally into the school and classroom setting. Most importantly, it can be taught in short, impactful lessons a few times a week. We're in classrooms across the country and world and receive incredibly positive feedback. Most importantly, I want to empower you with the awareness and information that has the potential to transform and save lives. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Please contact me with any questions you have. Together, we can create a safer, more peaceful and loving world. Thank you for choosing love. So many children come to school with problems that they never came with before. It has helped children open up express their feelings, and understand what making a positive choice in the area of love means. Every school needs to adopt this program.